So uh, what's your reaction, your initial reaction when you found out the news? Just excited. Um, it's kind of surreal. It hasn't really sunk in yet. Um, just kind of excited to get to work and, and uh, see where I'm going and, and all that. So It's all pretty fresh, but has it hit you that, that you just got drafted by a big league team? It's got to be a lifelong dream. Yeah, definitely. As a little kid, you dream of being a big leaguer and playing professional baseball, and that's obviously your ultimate goal um, individually. So, I mean, yeah, it's it's a dream come true to, especially for my family. They're they're uh, unbelievably excited for me, so it's it's great. Uh, not that you know the big picture of the organization, but um, where do you see yourself fitting in and, and, and the journey ahead? Because it's a, it's a long one to get to the big leagues, but this is the first step. Right. Yeah. Just step by step, basically. That's what I'm just looking for the next step, and uh, wherever wherever I can be the most service, so that's where I'm going to play. And, um, right now, I, I would imagine they want me catching. So, uh, yeah, just whatever I can help the organization with, I'm going to do. So, yeah, is that a, a preference you want to catch? You do you think that's an easier path up? I, I, I'm assuming that that's a, a kind of a lesser commodity in terms of numbers, and, and the good ones usually move up a little quicker. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, I think uh, it's uh, definitely rare to have a good catcher, solid defensive catcher. So I think. Uh, that's what a team's looking for. So, but I'd be open to playing other positions, obviously too. So, whatever they want me or need me to do, I'll, I'll be uh, happy to help the organization. So, mm -hmm. uh, just a way that this season wrapped up for you guys. How much do you think maybe it helped you in this whole equation? Do you think it helped? Oh, definitely. Um, overcoming all the adversity that we had this year as a team and individually, um, there were some lows, and and Coach Service just kept instilling in us: stay the course, stay positive good things will happen and they did and uh, it's just a testament how good a coach he is and how uh, how great he knows how to handle guys and, and keep us positive and keep us looking forward and um, can't thank him enough. So. And the way the state of the program to where you're leaving it now to where you came in you've got to feel pretty good about where you're leaving this program moving forward. Yeah definitely I, that was one of my goals I wanted to to be on winning teams and, and uh, I think with two uh, NBC championships. I think that's uh, it's it's great for the program going forward. For especially in the new ballpark, it's it's just good. So. Boys, don't let me jump. You know, monopolize. Yeah, you hold another microphone. <laughs> you want to ask it? Is it the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim or Anaheim <laughs> Angels of Los Angeles? Or yeah, I think that out yet? Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. I think that's what it is. <laughs> What about going to an organization that, that's known for bringing up guys to their farm system, Trout and Trumbo and Weaver and guys like that? Is, is it good knowing that this is a team that puts money into that farm system? Yeah, it's definitely encouraging to know that the organization puts a lot of stock in their farm system and and will support their minor league players. And it's, yeah, it's just uh, it's really encouraging to have that. So. What are you looking forward to the most? I mean, you play baseball all your life. Now you're going to get paid for it. What, mm -hmm. What's the thing that you look most forward to? Just getting better, playing against the best players in the world, and and see how long, see how far I can go. Um, just see how see how much I uh, can get out of it. So um, wouldn't want to do anything other, anything else. That's for sure. So are you ready for the mental challenges? Because that's a lot of it. You know, mm -hmm. over because it's not going to be all smooth sailing, right? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think the last couple summers playing in the Northwoods, a lot of games with wood bat against good competition. I think that's helped me prepare both mentally and physically just through the the grind of playing every day. So I think that's that's definitely a good stepping stone for me for the next level. So what was your first reaction when you heard? Uh just kind of surprised actually because I wasn't wasn't paying attention to the draft fully so I just I was kind of surprised he said congratulations that I didn't know what for yet. So <laughs> but yeah it's it's definitely uh kind of surreal it hasn't really fully hit me yet so did, you did that by design because you didn't want to. I mean, if you watch the computer, it can drive you crazy, yeah. right? I mean, yeah, definitely. I didn't want to be glued to a computer screen all day. I just wanted to keep my mind off it, stay busy, and just keep it as normal as I could. And you're so. moving. That's what you're doing. Yeah, right? moving, <laughs> moving out of my house. That's great. So. Awesome. All right.